It is Olympic in the dark blue, kicking things off from right to left. And again, two teams that like to move the ball around nicely, and they start moving the ball around nicely to Matt Mundy. Plays the ball inside to shell for Dias. Dias has support instantly through Dan Leck. And what a start for Olympic. 15 seconds of brilliance. And the erstwhile hosts have the opening goal. And it's Dan Leck. So often, Olympics hero who gets this home support off their feet. He has two second place finishes, a fourth and an hour third in his four years at Olympic. It's an incredible record, incredible achievement from one of the hottest young coaches around. Good ball into the middle and Adams had a really good opportunity there. Some of the dirty work. Millard just wins out there. Millard does really well to skip past two more challenges. Cuts the ball back and it is Zabala. And then the shot following up from Eli Adams well over the bar, but Mundy goes through. <laughs> That's really good composure from Millard. I've been impressed by him early on. He skips past a couple of challenges here and Raw have a bit of an overlap over on that far side of the field. Oh, it's a really nice, clever pass. Oh, and that's just flashed across the face. Dan Leck in space. Dias, Brady. Brady into the penalty area. Brady, it's a good save from Jackson Riley. From Millard. He was bamboozled a little by a trickery from Mundy and then showing a little bit too much with Sam Klein and Sam Klein is going to be shown a red card. And the boot must have been high and everyone's pushing and shoving everyone else. And yeah, it was because the boot was high, Zach Keenan making that perfectly clear. So the Brisbane Raw youth down a goal and down a man, Sam Klein sent off for the first time this season. Into a spot of bother though in the end, in the form of Glover and looked like Sayers was hanging about as well. Here's Leck on the edge of the penalty area up against Simpkin, Leck needs support. Oh that's a brilliant leave, Steve White 2-0 on it back and one foot in the grand final. It's Steve White's first goal in seven matches. He's fourth of the season and the 24-year-old has struck just when it counts. Elter scoring four of his first 15 games, scoring 16 goals. He scored earlier tonight. Lack! Oh, it's off the base of the post. Cernak puts the ball in the back of the net and surely puts Olympic into the grand final for 2021. Leck, that's excellent strength from Leck. Ball's fallen for Saros. Saros with the shot, it's a good save. Arriving is Puridel. Sorry. It's been relatively comfortable for Olympic, really. They've had to weather pressure for from the Roar at times. Of course they have us. Leck strides forward, plays in Saros. Saros teasing ball across, and Barlow was arriving. And the ball's still pinballing around there in the form of Reese Gray. Gray skips past one, skips past a second, skips past a third, puts a cross in. It's gathered above his head by Lockie Hunter and there will be no goal because the full-time whistle has been blown and the Olympic juniors stream onto the pitch. Olympic are in a fourth grand final. And it's a tremendous testament to what Ben Khan has achieved here at Olympic over the last four years. He's gone over to congratulate the raw youth players and coaching staff. It wasn't to be for the raw youth. Disappointment for them, I'm sure.